to Masterpiece Christmas Theater. My name is Chris Crawford the Donkey. Our story is one I witnessed a long time ago as a young, young donkey. So nothing like will I tell you about a very special night. It all began early one morning as I was munching on breakfast of sweet delightful grass. My master Joseph came from the house carrying my bridle and sacks of supplies for a journey. heavier than the last time I carried her. The road took us over steep rocky hills and into cool green valleys. We passed through quiet villages and busy towns. in Bethlehem. The city buzzed with people who came from near and far. There were lots of other donkeys too. Finally, Joseph found it a kind innkeeper. At first, the innkeeper shook his head and turned them away. I am very sorry. I have no room for you at the inn. But then he noticed Mary. It is, a li it is late, and you are both tired. You are welcome to stay in my stable. It is not much, but at least you will be able to get some rest. Joseph took the heavy bags off my back. Water for supper. Mary and Joseph didn't usually sleep with cows or sheep or even donkeys, but then they stretched out on the bed of straw and rested, and all was calm and the stars were bright. While they were there, the time came for the baby to be born, and she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in cloth and placed him in a manger, because there was no room for them in the inn. It was warm and comfortable in that stable. I had nodded off to sleep too. Then I heard it, the sound of a, a, a. Mary 
Mary had given birth to a baby boy. She named him Jesus. Then they wrapped him in cloths and laid him in the manger. That is where we animals ate our hay, you know. I clip cloth over to where he lay. What a sweet little child. I could have I could tell he was very special. I fell asleep again. Then excited voices jolted me away. And there were shepherds living in a living up in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Suddenly, a great company of heavenly hosts appeared with the angel, praising God and saying,
dropped to their knees by the manger, as quiet and as and still as a statue. They gazed at the baby, baby Jesus. Then one of the shepherds told his amazing story of the bright star and the angels in the field where they were tending to their sheep. It was amazing. You should have heard them singing and praising. I wonder if people believe the shepherds. Well, whether or not the other people believe the, the, the story, I believe them. Mary treasured up all these things and pondered them in her heart. The shepherds returned glorifying and praising God for all the things they had heard and seen, which were just as they had been told. Near baby Jesus, I felt peaceful as a lamb, from the tip of my nose to the wrist of my tail. I was there that special night when Mary gave birth to baby Jesus. That is the Christ, Jesus the savior of the world. I watched as Mary and Joseph kissed his rosy cheeks and sang soft and a beautiful lullaby. <laughs>